Hi, this is Nick at Crazy PC. Today we're going to take a look at the new SwiftTech H20 220 Edge. This is their new water cooling kit. And uh, it comes with, uh, here we see the instructions. And as usual, SwiftTech instructions are, are fairly extensive. Got the usual performance curves, uh, installation instructions, specifications. So pretty good coverage for everything you need. Um, also an installation disc, nice touch. I haven't seen that before. Okay, this is the uh, MCB120 uh, rad box. This is for mounting the radiator. Uh, you can use this to mount it to a uh, fan holes on your case. Something new also, I believe, with their kits, they uh, normally don't include um, three quarter inch outer diameter. They usually use the five eighths. This is three quarter inch outer diameter, half inch inner. So it's a thicker tubing, which means uh, it's less likely to collapse. So when you bend it, the tube won't pinch as much, so that's a good quality tubing there. Uh, usual, as usual, they include uh, Hydrix, uh, which we actually don't prefer to use. We recommend using like a faster coolant, just a little bit better coolant than this. Okay, some wire adapters. Fill port hardware. Um, alternate mount pack and uh, screws. Okay, a little funnel kit, that's nice. So you fill up your fluid. Alright, now we get to the good stuff here. We've got the SwiftTech Apogee XTL. This is the same block as the Apogee XT. Uh, it's a slightly less expensive version and what they've done is they've replaced the top of the unit with a all Delrin made uh, top, so it's a little less expensive, but it doesn't hurt performance or affect performance. So um, in in this kit, in this uh, box for the CPU block, we've got the uh, fittings. System comes with uh, half inch fittings. You got your mounting plates. By default, uh, it's supporting Intel socket seven uh, seven five and socket 1366 and 1156. Uh, AMD brackets are available as well as um, Xeon 771 brackets. Let me just take a look at the block here. Okay, so there's the block. So it's the same block, just a different top. Okay, so now we're going to take a look at the radiator. This is an integrated radiator pump and reservoir. It's called the MCR220 Drive. They've got it in this nice uh, it's like a cloth wrapping. Uh, it includes the clamps for the hose and fittings, half inch fittings. Alright, taking a look at this radiator. It comes with two 120 millimeter fans. And on the end here, we see the MCP35X pump. And the pump has on it uh, two sets of wires, has a uh, four pin connector for going direct to the power supply, and also a um, PWM style connector. And this go, will go to your motherboard, so I imagine you can do it either way. On the uh, opposite end, of this radiator we have the reservoir and this uh, comes with uh, two fill ports so depending on how you mount it, if you mount it vertically or horizontally you can use either side. And now uh, taking a look, flipping this over, you see the fins of the radiator and we see the uh, input and output ports so we hook, hook up our fittings here, our half inch fittings. You can use 3 8 fittings as well but the system comes with half inch by default. Uh, there we see the input port is labeled. OK, 
Okay, now let's take a look at the dimensions. Dimensions are it's approximately in length. We're looking at 12 and 5 eighths. On width, we're at about five inches wide. Now thickness, we've got some uh, different things going on here. So on the end with the reservoir, thickness is approximately two and a quarter. And on the end with the pump, we have this little part that it's coming out, so it makes it a little wider. So here we're looking at approximately three and an eighth. One last note too with these fans, we have uh, three pin connectors, so you can hook these to your motherboard. But SwiftTech also includes some uh, wire adapters, so you can convert it from three to four pin. It's a nice compact kit, uh, easy to install. Uh, looks like it has all the good features of the high-end high, high -end kits. This is a high-end kit actually, it's just more compact and easy to install. So visit uh, crazypc.com for water cooling parts and more. Thank you.